the Rig Rat. Hey there, this is an unboxing video of the Roland V Accordion FR 1X. Uh, which is an accordion that produces no sound on its own except for electronically. And uh, it runs on batteries, which I bought yesterday. Special kind of battery. Uh, and uh, this is the charger that comes with it. I bought this at Walmart for 13 bucks. I guess Best Buy had it for 10 something. And uh, this is the stuff you got to buy. Uh, you know, this is an, the additional cost when you get into the batteries and stuff like that. I imagine one good thing among many good things about, about battery operated uh, accordion is, of course, strolling around. And that's more engaging to the audience. And that's what we want to do. We want to entertain the audience. And anyway, plus you won't be stepping on the power cord and ruining it and breaking it and uh, whatever. Anyway. So I'm going to try to get on with this boxing video. Uh, I ordered... I ordered a padded case with it. Now that's just sort of a partial bundle through Craft Music. And here we go. This is the first thing. Unboxing the padded case. Ooh, it's a nice red. I'm, I'm of course, wondering about the color of the red accordion. You know, is it... You know, I'm pretty particular about different shades of red, different... Uh, Tones, different tints, different colors of red. This red is excellent. It's beautiful. Uh, it's beautiful. Look at the picture. Not the same red as what I'm holding. And I dig it. I love this. I was born 1961, and I just said, I dig it. I was born... <laughs> so this red is way better. I dig it. Okay. And uh, let's unbox it, shall we? Okay. Here, it's taped over here. Well, let's take a look. It says V accordion, very nice. Uh oh, there's yellow there. Let's keep it white and red and black, okay? Let's let's not introduce these colors, other colors, because red, black, and white are the best. Oh, oh, oh. Untape that. And when you have unboxed musical equipment as long as I, what you like to do is, um, ooh, there's, there's a zipper here. What you like to do is uh, make sure the plastic is slowly taken off. Okay, throw it away. So you got a tag with all kinds of information. Boy, look at that. Isn't that wonderful? <laughs> That's a beautiful red, very nice, shiny, almost metallic, uh, something going on there. Uh, now, what are you going to do? You're going to put the accordion in your, <laughs> um, in this bag, and then what? Put it on your passenger car seat, and uh, off you go. But I am going to have to construct something, probably out of wood, to put this in the accordion in the bag, and then this going in the structure I'm going to create. I wish SKB made one, but I don't have the money for SKB. Sometimes these SKB cases cost more than the instrument themselves. All right. It's beautiful. It's, uh, has a zipper and this seems, oh, that's, that's leather. That's real leather. Uh, I believe, and uh, seems very nice, but it's not going to protect it as much as I need it. Oh, what's that, a backpack? Boy, oh boy, 
the knapsack on my back. <laughs> Valerie, I'm going to hike through the uh, mountains with my accordion and the batteries will run out. Okay, I'll plug into a tree or something and I'm going to put that aside for now. In the box, you get Music is Essential. You get that wonderful Music is Essential <laughs> uh, sticker from Craft Music. Sorry, Guitar Center. <laughs> sorry, Sweetwater. Uh, sorry, uh, I've never used... Uh, what's the other guys? Sam Ash. Oh, what's this giving me? Uh... Can you believe it? Like two hours into the video, we're going to actually unbox... Hey! It doesn't weigh much. The now the Roland FR One X, and this is in red. And I, boy, when I see that red, I'm gonna I'm gonna be honest about you know if it's the shade of red I enjoy. Um, the sh the black or red, and the black would give you a little more uh, street cred when it comes to accordions, but the red is flashy. Now look at this. On the front, they indicate it's the piano accordion, not the button. Well, we could, that's another thing. But on the left-hand side is, of course, buttons. I used to have two accordions. Um, I never properly learned the buttons, but now buying this, I've committed to the idea of learning the left-hand um, button uh, world. And it's like buying a, a woodwind instrument, a sight unseen, like a clarinet or a saxophone, to have no idea what those uh, valves and stuff do. I mean, I played a trumpet when I was in elementary, but I didn't learn that very well either. Here we go. There's a lot of money for you out there who think... That's just, that's just a lot of money. But they say, when you compare to, you know, buying a real accordion that has all these different sounds and sets, you'd have to buy many different accordions. I wish they had a MIDI in as well as a MIDI out. But they do have the USB MIDI uh, port, and I'm sure that that will work with the sequencing and stuff like that. Oh, it looks like it's finally open. Okay. All right. Still working on this here. Here we go. Uh-oh, I don't want that to happen. Look at that knife. Now that's a knife. Oh, this is it. This is it. Wow. See, I'm a solo performer. Look at all of that. Oh, it tells you, before you go any, any further, it tells you how to go about pulling this out of the box. By the way, I found this on my porch as is. Uh, I was supposed to sign for it. I was expecting the guy to knock on the door and sign for it. I think we ordered it uh, Saturday or Sunday. And uh, it came on Tuesday. Uh, I'm not going to pay much attention to how they recommend taking stuff out of the box. Maybe I should. Yeah, maybe I should. All right. I don't know if I'll need a knife any further, but here we go. We're going to put this on its side. Like that. Put that chair like that, more secure. Here we go. Can you? Are you catching all this? Huh? All right, here we go. Ooh, the straps. Are they gonna, 
Are they gonna bother me? Am I gonna be all uh, in the hot summertime and whatever? These straps, I'm gonna go tug at these straps and say, oh, I gotta get comfortable here. There they are. No leather involved and the foam feels doesn't, well, we'll, we'll see how long the foam hangs in there. And who knows, maybe I'll have to buy more straps. The straps seem pretty light, of course, even compared to the accordions I've had in the past. All right, this is it. Huh? Power. How I would love to just have a backup power supply. Not only that, I wouldn't mind a backup uh, accordion, but uh, <laughs> I can't imagine, huh? Definitely bought this on credit, did not pay full price. I mean, I didn't pay, I mean, I got a good deal from Kraft Music, but did not uh, pay in one lump sum. Okay, obviously we need this part and it's gotta be somewhere, but I don't know. I think it's telling me. Oops, I feel something else in there. Ooh, what do we got? What do we got? We got this. Hey. All this packaging for the other power. Oops. All right. There it is, the manual. Well, if you're a watcher of the Rig Rat, and if you're not, you're missing out on so many great videos. You know that I love, when I get the manual, oh, look at that bubble wrap. Mm, good smelling bubble wrap, that stuff. Um, when I get the manual, oh, how I love to, uh, well, just get a glass of Merlot, kick back on the couch, maybe light some candles, and read, read the manual. Actually, I've already read it, the downloaded version, but oh, when you hold it in your hands with this uh, top-of-the-line illustrations, wow-wee, look at that. Gee, there it is. If only I saw it in person. I do. I'm going to open it in just a second. Uh, now, there you go. You, you can see the extra buttons they give you. Not just necessarily extra buttons, but some of those, I think, have different indentations or are indented or not indented. Indented, and I don't know. I'm going to have to uh, look into that. Maybe here's a better shot. Does that seem better? All right, there we have the other end of the power. We got the extra buttons, caps, and here is some more stuff from Roland. Ooh, they added something is so they can cover their selves from legal stuff. Okay, putting that all nicely somewhere. Also, now this. There's some Velcro, probably very, very important stuff, that Velcro right there. I don't know. I'm sure you need it. Hope I don't lose it. Here we go. All right, feeling in here. I don't feel anything that way. I don't feel anything that way. This is it. This is the big money shot. Here it comes. Yikes. I'm going to pull it out. Here we go. Oh, I can't do it alone. Maybe if I put my foot like that. No. I, I don't know. I'm going to use gravity. The Earth's gravity. The core of the Earth has the gravity. The pull. If you ever noticed about uh, gravity. Okay. Well, we'll never really get it out. Folks. Oh, something's happening. Something's happening. It doesn't want to come out because it knows I don't deserve it. 
Uh, it says, please, let somebody else play me who really knows how to play the accordion. Well, I'm going to learn, my friend. Okay. Pulling. Wow. Now this, uh, can you see this material? This cottony material here is really, it's, it's, boy, this ain't no cheap, uh, if I, as I pull on it, it's really uh, keeping its integrity. All right, here we go. So when you unbox one, make sure to get a couple friends over. All right. Now, see in that box? I don't see, I don't see anything else in there. So, we give it the old shove. You know, I shouldn't act that way to our friend in the box. Hmm? Let's take a look at what was really all the packaging was about. Okay. We know it had that wonderful illustration there. And there's on this front. You know, I've seen on YouTube some uh, about the FR1, not with the X, when they first came out. Uh, um, anyway, they don't have a, the, the original one didn't have a speaker. Here's that side of the packaging. Here's this side of the packaging, a digital accordion. And there's that side. I know, but you also get to see the bottom. Oh, there it is. Anyway, that's the box. But what I'm saying is one of the videos on YouTube showed uh, a white FR-1 uh, taken apart. And then you see the green uh, circuit boards and stuff, and it kind of takes the magic out of it. And it, it, it makes you think, man, I'm paying thousands of dollars. And really, it all comes down to circuit boards and stuff like that. Will, will it hold up? You know, I mean, you guys who play real accordions, you know, you have that advantage. You know, you know it's going to work. I guess you run into repair trouble. But hopefully this doesn't... And, and there's other YouTube videos of, of guys wearing out even uh, parts of the V accordion. I'm super happy to have this. I probably have it upside down, but that is where an, a handle is. And here we go. We're going to remove... Oh! takes a lot of effort. Remove that uh, styrofoam. It's, maybe it's more than styrofoam. That's pretty, pretty cool stuff. It's almost, it probably would hold up to many a uh, transportation. Now, it's got a piece of tape there, and this is it. Oh, and the red is beautiful. The red is really, really, really nice. Wow, here we go. And it's got these little rubber feet. That, oh no, I don't deserve this thing. I don't deserve anything. But there it is. The Roland V Dash Accordion FR Dash 1X. Or if you'd like, you can refer to it as the Roland V Accordion FR Dash 1X. Or if you'd like to refer to it, call it the Roland FR1X. But there it is. Is it beautiful or what? Oh, it sure is. It's awful pretty. And uh, I'm going to feel the keys for the first time. And uh, they feel wonderful. Me, I don't have the biggest hands. I don't have the biggest hands. I don't have the smallest hands. But uh, those keys, I, I'll be able to play. I know. I know. 
Oh, it's too nice. It's too nice. I'm going to show this camera. show it to this camera. So, I don't know. Holding it in midair, spinning it. Stupid of me. This strap seems very sturdy. I'm not going to play it. Sorry. Not right now. Not in this video, baby. Uh-oh, what's that? Really? Made in Italy? How cool! I'm sorry, but that makes me even happier. Wow! There's the port for uh, USB flash drive so you can play backing tracks and pretend to play the accordion just kidding wow that red is beautiful it is beautiful wow the back where we are going to put in the batteries Man, I already got fingerprints all over it. Yes, it takes eight. Double A. Use the NIMH. Double A, it says. If you're like me and you can't, you got us. It's a lot of money to spend such a thing. Spend on such a thing, then you do a lot of research and you. And you say, boy, I'm going to at least learn all I can. It's so much dough. Well, I don't know. Now for the first time, I'm going to feel the buttons. Wow. I thought there'd be more resistance. It feels wonderful. Wow. The buttons feel great. An amazing thing that you could actually entertain people with just these buttons, bass and chords and whatever. What it all comes down to is I'm a singer. And uh, I'm just backing myself up. Oh, baby. This does not weigh much. What do they say? 14 pounds? 15? Trying to give you views you never saw in other videos. But the red is really great. There it is. Now, it does have feet, which aren't really setting on this stool very well. But the strap is somehow tucked away where the feet do keep it stable on a surface. Gosh, it's beautiful. There it is. One long video, huh? There's, there's amazing, 
accordion guys out there that uh, I really enjoy watching and accordion girls, gals and guys. Anyway, thanks for watching. Uh, do me a favor. Wish me luck with the uh, left-hand bass buttons. Do you use the ring finger mostly? Or are you a 3-2 guy on the left hand? 3 and 2, 3 and 2. Or are you going to be uh, where you listen to some of the other people say, use your ring finger, the fourth finger, a 4-3-2 guy to really um, to get a better reach and more versatility when it comes to this and that. And it's hard to, hard to distinguish what some uh, are using the methods they use. Anyway, you've had enough, haven't you? That's it. Go back to your life. Thank you for watching this edition of The Rig Rat. Bye.